Hey guys, it's me, Martin Core, and it is quite late here, and um, I apologize for the lack of vlog. Yesterday, time just kind of got away from me. It was, uh, it was a very busy and fun day, but I just couldn't do it. I just didn't have the time, and for that, I apologize. But I would like to draw your attention to the fact that this is my 100th vlog video, which is very exciting. I'm uh, pleased that this channel has been as successful as it's been, and um, I'm really glad that you guys like the cooking with Martin Core and the daily vlogs, or when I go somewhere, or when I'm just talking about various news things, I'm glad that you guys are receptive to this, and it makes me want to keep going, which is awesome, because I love doing the game stuff, and I love doing the face-to-face -face stuff, and it just makes me quite happy. So thank you very much for giving me the opportunity to continue doing these things. My day was very successful. I just got back from the studio, where we spent about six hours recording uh, three songs, and they came out really well. And on Wednesday, I will mix them down and hand them in on Thursday for a project, which I'm really excited to finish. And tomorrow, I've got my um, 8 a.m. morning class, as usual, and then I'm off to um, the city council again to do another midnight brief for a story, which I'm looking forward to, and um, just some other assignments throughout the week that I've got that are going to be really cool to get finished and move on from. Uh, is there anything else kind of really going on in my neck of the woods? Videos are going great. Uh, we've had a subscriber spike over the last few days, so hello new people to uh, the channels. I appreciate your um, continued support and um, it really makes me happy every time I like wake up or I leave for a few hours and come back and the numbers increased by a, by a sizable amount. Like, um, I think we went up in about maybe 20 people over the last three days, which is awesome. I love that kind of growth. Makes me super happy. So, and it makes my dream of having a thousand subscribers before the year's out almost possible. And I'm very excited. We're, we're over the halfway point to 800. Um, we're, we're at like 750 something. So we're getting, we're getting really close to 800, which means there's only like, oh, so many to go before we hit a thousand before the year's out. And I'm really thinking it's possible, especially with the predicted bump. And Christmas, when content triples, um, from like one video a day to like three videos a day. So I'm very excited and I'm thinking it's possible. And I'm hoping that it'll happen because it'll just be such an amazing milestone. I'm really looking forward to that day. Let's see what else is going on. Studio went well. Uh, everything on my end is going good. You know, I'm doing the gym, you know, my morning bike rides, all that kind of stuff. Uh, family's good. I turned in my final application for the radio internship. So hopefully I will hear back from them some point this week. I'll keep you guys posted on that. Um, in case there's any sort of confusion or anything of the sort, I am not doing the Disney internship. I just want to clarify that. Um, it's not happening this time around. In the future, I may apply again for a different time slot and be a bit more specific with my choices, and then maybe it'll happen, but it is not happening right now. So I will be here come January for uh, videos and whatnot. I'm basically going to finish out this year and to do that kind of stuff. And, um... My family's good. I saw them on Saturday. It was really fun to catch up and see how they're doing, and they're doing great. Um, she, my mom, dropped off uh, a big slab of homemade lasagna. Oh man, it's so good. It was it was amazing. It was it was a dinner and a breakfast. Just polish it off. It was delicious. And what else? I'm drinking a lot of lemonade and cider, which are both delicious, but not really healthy for you. So I'm balancing it off with like a lot of tea and water and milk. That's like all I drink. No soda, no nothing like that. Lemonade, milk, tea, and now that it's fall cider. And uh, come like next March, alcohol probably will get mixed in there as well. Being honest, like it's probably going to be a thing that I do every now and then because once it becomes an option, I'm going to pursue that option. So I'm very excited. We got the Legend of Korra game coming out this Tuesday and I'm very excited to get that. The train. Um, it's been raining on and off all like weekend. It's not the greatest, but it is what it is. I figured out how to take the bus. Oh, it's so great. It's um, like, say I have an 8 a.m. class, the bus leaves at the downtown station at 7.25. So um, it takes me about seven minutes to walk to the bus station. So if I leave here around like 7.10, I get there. The bus shows up a few minutes later. I get on the bus, it takes me straight to campus. I get off the bus, I can hang out, you know. It's so convenient. Uh, and then I just walk home, because it's like, if it's raining and stuff, I like my hair 
gets fucked in the rain. So if I take the bus, it gets less fucked. But walking home, when I don't have class anymore, I don't care. So if it gets all wet, then I can just take a shower and change and all that stuff. And I also figured out today that I probably have somewhere in the neighborhood of like 75 to 80 different kinds of t-shirts. Well, not different kinds, but 80 it's like black t-shirts. It's, it's a sizable collection. I have four drawers out of my six drawer dresser dedicated to t-shirts. And that's it. They're just full of t-shirts. So I'm thinking it might be time to kind of paw through them and get rid of some. And in the vein of t-shirts, um, a few people, a few, not that many, but a few um, people have expressed interest, including myself, have expressed interest in um, getting some t-shirts for like this area of YouTube, this group of people. I hesitate to say fan base because, you know, it's, it's a sizable group of people, but are we a fan base? I'm not, I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure if it's, I would like to think like maybe 1,500 to like 2,000 people is a fan base, but if you guys think you're a fan base, then awesome. I, I think of you as a fan base because you're hopefully my fans and um, you are here. So I was thinking of um, talking to some of my artist, artist friends and getting some preliminary designs for some potential t-shirts um, that might become available via a Spreadshirt store because my network has an in. And um, if I can get some mock-up designs and maybe come up with a few options, I can send them your guys' way and then you can let me know if there's one you like more than the other and we can make some t-shirts. And I think that'd be, in May, it'd be incredible because I've always wanted like merchandise related to what I do in a very vain, cynical, I'm better than you kind of way. <laughs> I'm just like, I would love a t-shirt with my name on it. I mean, fucking Tobuscus wears his own shit all the time, and I'm like, I would be that guy. If I had, a, like, a Martin Core t-shirt, I'd wear that shit all the time. But, um, I have a few, like, lines that I've kind of kept in the back of my head of things that I say all the time. Like, uh, because of reasons I want, like, on a t-shirt. I, I kind of want to do, like, fuck you, Umbridge, or goddammit, Ron, and, like, the Harry Potter stuff, but I don't like t-shirts with swears, because those aren't as appropriate most of the time, so... Maybe those could be like prints or something, I don't know. But I'm gonna talk to some artists, um, see if I can get some commissioned stuff, and uh, we'll move on from there. So if you want a t-shirt, please let me know in the comments if that's something you'd be interested in. And uh, if it's a big thing, if like a lot of people express interest, I will definitely pursue that and see if we can get some t-shirts. Maybe in time for the holiday season, we'll get some Margincore merch. God damn it, I want my name on a mug so badly. I want a Margincore mug. I will make it happen. If there's any kind of demand for merchandise, I will make it happen. I will promise you that. And on that note, I think I will wrap it up there. It is quite late, and um, I kind of want to get to bed before I have to wake up for tomorrow's class. So thank you very much for watching, everybody, and I will see you all tomorrow. And thank you for 100 videos and just being generally amazing and awesome people. I really do appreciate your support, and it keeps me pumped to continue doing what I love to do. Have a good one, guys.